There's only two outcomes with my art. Either it's good slash decent, or... Let me explain. This is the Tunnel of Ants. These are some clouds for ambiance, and all the broken hearts are because they're getting bullied. Also because they put their production company out of business. But lovers. Today is the day we watch Ant Bully as part of a series watching blank. Usually drunk, as you know, Drunk Athena's coming back in May. Why Ant Bully? Well, as you can see, I did a lore video on Jimmy Neutron this month, and as I was doing research, I realized that DNA Productions actually went out of business because of the box office failure that is the Ant Bully. But I got a mix of comments either saying it was terrible, it wasn't as bad as I thought it would be, and some of my commenters even thought it was good, despite these atrocious ratings. My verdict? I haven't seen it yet. I have. He speaks. I think I saw this in theaters. I remember nothing about it. All I remember is there's a kid and he bullied the ant so hard that Jimmy Neutron got canceled. I also just have to point out A Bug's Life, 1998. Ants with a Z that my sister that one time pronounced ants. 1998. The ant bully? 2006? They're so 2000 and late, bro. Today we're drinking kombucha. What I usually do when I'm wearing makeup, I don't want to ruin my lips, is I drink like this. You stick out your tongue a little bit. What the fuck did you say? Hey, what are you doing? Oh uh, yeah, this is sleeping chamber. Go to sleep. It's terrible timing to say this, but that one ant's voice kind of reminded me of like, Oh. Maybe that guy should audition to be the new Morty. They have an opening, guy. You ready for another job? I'm coming up there! <laughs> <laughs> Did you just kill a guy? Maybe the real Ant Bully was this guy all along. Come on, man. I'm running out of underwear. Well, what are you gonna do about it, huh? Nothing. Because I'm big. And you're small. This is like if an AI wrote a bully character. Yeah. That kid grew up to be Bill Gates. Now, let me see it think. <gasps> I sense a beta. Ooh, he has a girly friend. Also, how does that one ant straight up have magical powers? What are you talking about? He like fired like an energy beam into the side of the cave earlier. No, I thought he was just banging a stick against it. Well, he was, but then he shot like a green beam of light. I missed that. I will use my powers to destroy you. Powers that I have yet to perfect. Main character syndrome. Imagine if somebody came up to me in a threatening matter and I was like, you can't do this to me. I'm manifesting <laughs> that I come out of the situation safe. Peanut, it's time to come inside now. She is exactly like Judy. Redhead. Yeah. Thick. I like that they put a texture on their eyes. I don't know why. I thought that, I think that's a pretty cool detail. It's our big wedding anniversary. We're going to Puerco Vallarta. And I got to spend a little quality time with the Mama Sita. Ooh, <laughs> he would. I can solve my own problems. Uh-oh, got your coping skill. Let's see what it is. That's not a coping skill. <laughs> it's a version of Frogger where you I kill Frogger <laughs> on purpose. Well, I'm glad you two have something to laugh about. <laughs> ah! Head of council. Hi. How nice of you two, uh. Oh. Huh? It's so funny that he had so much restraint when walking in on them tickling each other. Just to say something like semi calmly, and then you see his face and he's like, Why won't you invite me to the tickle party? <laughs> so I'm confused as to what this main character Ant's role is. Yeah, right? Because in the beginning, when all of them were sleeping, they're like, Oh, you crazy kook! Go to sleep! And now the head of the council, the Ant Luminati, is like, We trust you with the highest honor of saving the entire. Ant world. The council was hoping perhaps you might have a solution. Which is it? We don't like or respect you as a person, but we also trust you to save mm. our species from extinction. Save us! <laughs> Please! Uh. What are you doing? Preventing avian abduction. That's what I'm doing. I want to smoke weed with her. I don't have any friends. Well, who's gonna look out for you when you get old and your teeth are falling out? And them aliens are after you. That was probably the most insensitive way to talk to a kid about not having friends, though, I must say. <laughs> oh, you're a loser! <laughs> loser! <laughs> Dance, puke! <laughs> Did they just throw something in the water? 
A stick of dynamite? Jesus, I think killing him is going a little too far. Wait a second, has he even ever successfully killed any of the ants? This kid's so fucking pathetic. He's like going out of his way to try and kill ants and even they're outsmarting him. Like I feel bad for him like on a human to human level, but if he was like, do you wanna be my friend? I'd probably be like, um. Hey, is your grandma still in town? Sign a contract for me if I happen to forget to before I leave. He's a grown man now. His exact words. Hmm, I don't know. Yo, who does your thinking for you? Your mommy? Mommy, 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 what do I do? I'm just a little baby that can't think for myself. Please wipe my little bottom for me. Wipe me. Oh, 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 please. I feel like this is going on too long. I know he's supposed to be an evil character, but I feel like someone had too much fun writing for him. Yeah. If anything happens to Spindle, I'm actually gonna be really upset. Don't worry, Pass Athena. Nothing really happens to the little guy. He just becomes irrelevant and, and he doesn't do anything. We are lost. Such a nice place. We are lost. A potion? What exactly does it do? I don't know. <laughs> you just poured wax in the kid's ear. Say what you want about Lucas. Those gotta be the cleanest ears I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> Color me impressed. It's kind of scary, actually. Actually, I hate it. He's already small. We didn't even see it happen. That's such bullshit. We didn't even see him shrink. Also, that's unnecessary. Yeah. The clothes couldn't shrink with him. Well, he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> you did it. You killed the boy. Oh my god. Oh. Uh. She knows? Say what you will about the ant bully. This would be a fire universal ride. Yeah. POV, you were kidnapped by an ant. Oh, I would love this ride. <laughs> Me too. Oh. The end, they just kill you. <laughs> I hate that this reminds me of that thing from Spongebob that's like, a 40 mile spanking machine! <laughs> 7 mile spanking machine! Ah, ouch! Ouch! His skeleton is on the inside! It sounds like two rings from Word Girl. Which would mean it's Tom Kenny, which would make sense because he's in every single animated thing ever. Okay, but you guys are all about like, oh, he's hurting us unprovoked. What is that at your altar? Is that a monarch butterfly wing? What? What is that? I mean, it looks cool. I mean, I can't, I can't deny the drip. <laughs> no one hates unalive things more than me. That's my favorite, that's my least favorite thing. Did willfully end with malice aforethought, crush the food storage chambers, flood all the lower hatching chambers, and douse the colony with the dreaded yellow rain. With all of those charges, they still didn't mention any murder. At this point, yeah. if I were Lucas and I were to set out to destroy an anthill, I'd be like, I didn't kill any of you guys. They make <laughs> Lucas go even more to the dark side. Wow. He just gets jacked, but only to kill ants. <laughs> we haven't seen the queen yet. That's actually cool as fuck. There's this meme that's like, trying not to say mother for two minutes. <laughs> ma, 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 mommy, mother, mother. I was gonna say a really stupid joke. But I'm like, that might be taking it too far. I was gonna say, oh, I want ants in my pants, you know what I mean? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> How was I supposed to know ants had feelings or families or trials? They're just a bunch of stupid ants! In my defense, Your Honor, you're a fucking idiot and I hate you. <laughs> uh, please don't kill me. I therefore sentence the human to live and work in the colony to learn our ways. He must become an ant. What? No. Why is Lucas saying what? I'd be like, thank you. Thank you. You'd rather die than just be an ant for like a week? You're this already is... shrunk. You're either shrunk and dead or you're shrunk and, and you live. Kid, you're you're not being smart at all. Are you are you male or female? Uh, and how do you tell the difference? I mean, it's, oh, oh, is that how? <laughs> There's a lot of focus on like bodies and yeah. stuff in a very uncomfy way. Cross your heart. What? Oh, all right. Cross my heart, I will not eat you. I have seen this movie before. That's the only thing I remember. I have seen this movie before. I did not remember until now. Wow. I've seen this whole movie, and I think this entire time, I thought that this movie was Ants with the Z. <laughs> Meaning out of all three movies, the only one I haven't seen, I think, is Bugs Life, weirdly enough. Really? Yeah! Hello, baby. Fookax. Well, isn't it true that scout ants such as myself lead an exciting life of adventure and intrigue? Fookax! While foragers such as you just walk around and pick up sticks. 
Being sexist is so cool. Teach me how. Honestly, what also slowed you guys down was the fact that you had to do a chant before you stacked up. Like, the other team is already ahead of you. For once, it's not Lucas's fault. Boogity boogity! Lucas, take this shit seriously! Goddamn! So for Lucas to get to know how the ant colony works, he's doing field day with the school. It doesn't seem necessary to the plot, A. B, if somebody that, like, tried to murder my entire town got shrunk down, like, I wouldn't care that they were a kid of another species. Like, they're treating him really well. Yeah. They're like, oh, and you get to play with the other kids because you're just a little baby. Oh, you're just so tiny and cute and you're a little baby. All right! Thanks for trying. He didn't. The, what was the reason? It's to establish stakes, but I still don't like it. This is my least favorite fucking thing. They always do this. They show something cute getting absolutely obliterated in kids' media. And it's like... God, I fucking hate that. Or lifting ten times your own weight, or walking vertically up a wall, it's being part of a colony. Not always thinking of yourself first. Oh, careful! Oh, hey, don't touch me! This kid sucks. This kid wow. sucks. Fucking let him die. Let him die. <laughs> let him die, let him die. Let him shrivel up and die. What's that from again? I don't know. I thought you just made that no. up. I say let him die. Oh, it's from Lorax. Another movie I haven't seen. I haven't but that's, seen that either. But that's all over Twitter. We're cut off! <laughs> You see, Lucas, that's how you kill a bunch of ants. If I were one of the writers in this movie, it's like, hey, it may be cruel, but that's just a bug's life. Don't just stand there! Help her! Lucas, run! What are you doing? I like that they put that scene in. Because if I were the boyfriend, I would be livid. I'd be livid at Lucas. I'd be livid at my girlfriend for fucking trusting this guy. <laughs> yeah. That's a good scene, I gotta say. I, I'm definitely not enjoying this movie, mm -hmm. but like... I can call it a movie. Yeah. <laughs> That yeah. You saved us. No, no, if I was the boyfriend, I would not be having this. Yeah. Praise the destroyer! Wake up! He <laughs> saved himself! Yeah. I'm he did. sorry! He straight That's did. exactly what he did! Tom Hanks, based as always, I mm -hmm. see. The entire time we thought it was Tom Hanks. He's voiced by Nicolas Cage, so I don't know why, I don't know why we thought that. Zuck! <clears throat> oh, are you alright? <clears throat> I, I thought they were gonna run over to him and be like, Zuck! Stop being so mean to Lucas. <laughs> Doc, do you have any yucca sap? Lucas has a burn. Mm. Okay, yeah. He very nearly killed me. <sighs> what does that not matter to you? Stab. Lucas like, it is true, I did try and kill him. And they're all like, oh, Lucas! Oh, he's so <laughs> honest. <laughs> Oh, Lucas, I want to eat that so, so bad. Yeah, right? Oh. Oh. I remember this. I'd still eat it. I'm not really bothered by that. Eat this. It'll make you feel better. It's its penis. <laughs> Dare I say, this movie this is just Avatar. Is so, just to play a quick game of catch up, after they showed Lucas the god of the ant world, they were like, and this is, it, this is our Satan. And it was the exterminator. And he remembered, uh-oh, probably should cancel that now that we're frenzies. So they go into his house and now there's this weird jelly belly product placement. Hello, how are you? <laughs> Did you see that? What is going on? I'm so sorry. Hello, how are you? Let him go, it's me you want. Come back, <laughs> probe me instead. She said probe me instead. Grandma is freaky. I think she's a little bit too into the aliens. <laughs> I see a young pupa. Impossible. Listen to yourself, Zach. A wizard knows no such word. So what are you now? Certainly not the ant I love. That's like really intense. 
I don't know how long they've been together, but they're super in love. And he rejects the person that was trying to kill you guys. Yeah. Now you're questioning your whole relationship with him? That seems unreasonable. Mm -hmm. And it's also like, you weren't actively trying to get him to get to know Lucas. Honestly, if he had gotten to know Lucas, he would know, oh, Lucas is a little shit. <laughs> I did it for you. For the colony. You did it for yourself. No, he didn't! No, he didn't! I'm gonna have my millennial TikTok stitch moment where I go, Oh, actually, I can explain that. Hi, I can answer that. Uh, that's because your brain, uh, fucking fart shit poop. I think that these movies and TV shows and these lessons of like always apologizing regardless if the person deserves it or not is what made us all be giant pushovers. The media. <laughs> Lucas, Lucas, wait! We told Zog to go fuck himself. <laughs> Isn't that your husband? No. Yeah, but he doesn't deserve you. He doesn't deserve the little, our, our little oh. family, our little found family. I'm your mom now. Don't ever leave me again. Zach, you are my pupa, not Zog's. What? She literally was like, you're my baby. You know what it's, the energy it's giving? That lady that wrote a poem that was like, Donald Trump, if I was your mother, or no, no, it was, it was Putin. If I was your mother, I would have made you a better person. I can fix him. No. Climb! You can do it, just concentrate. Ugh. I'm an it. Uh, he manifested sticky <laughs> hands, so he had <laughs> sticky hands. Oh. Uh. Is that guy's even <laughs> Mr. Mr. Stark, Stark, I don't, don't feel, feel so good. good. Why did we both think of that? <laughs> hey, you can skip to this timestamp if you want. This next scene is nasty. I don't know why it's there. I'm I'm still upset. Like, I'm editing this right now and I'm pissed off. Why can't you be more, uh, hey, Lenny? <laughs> oh, I remember the scene. I remember oh, the scene. Oh, oh, ah, oh. Ah, 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 oh. I fucking hate that. Hey, Zach. Thanks, but why'd you do it? An ant will sacrifice himself for his friends. I, I thought you hated me. I didn't do it for you. Lucas is like, ah, we're friends now? No, you dense fuck. There's an ant in him. There's an <laughs> ant in him. Yeah, he ate one of the other villagers before, but like, like he apologized. Everything else is so different, but it's the same sky, the same stars. All right, Whitman. <laughs> All right. Are you ill? What? Oh, I mean yawning. I'm, I'm just tired. Please stop. It's disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> Look. Uh, what, what, what is it? What's wrong? I see her! Who her? The ant mother! She's come! She's here! All other religions are false! <laughs> We're the dominant life form! Oh, well, if it isn't, the actions of my own consequences. Did you mean to do that? Wait. <laughs> Wait, no. <laughs> the exterminator came to kill our brain cells. Whoa. The cloud is coming. <laughs> the cloud. The fog is coming. The fog is coming. The fog is coming. The fog. Do you lift, bro? Do you lift, bro? When did he get that strong? Lucas. If he like starts climbing with the ones. <laughs> ah, he's OP. <laughs> He has too much power! <laughs> Thanks, kid. When did you get so jacked? <laughs> mm. Hey, that looks vulnerable. Perfect! <laughs> they have way too much focus on anatomy in this movie. Yeah. What? What is happening? What is this? What, what is happening? What? Look what I got. Oh, yeah. yay. Now they can get freaky yay. again. Aunt sex, aunt sex, aunt sex, aunt sex, aunt sex, aunt sex. Oh, I, I don't know why I literally thought he was gonna squirt the animal again. I was like, what the fuck? Dark. What did we learn? The bully of my bully is my, is my friend. The bullies, the bu the bullies.